Center of Excellence in Advanced Material Research at BMS College of Engineering has been established in the year 2013 under World Bank Project Technical Education Quality Improvement Program TECIP Phase 2 under subcomponent 1.2.1 with a financial grant of 500 lakhs. Under Center of Excellence in Advanced Material Research, high-end research facilities has been established in the form of four research laboratories that is SEM XRD Lab, Phase Change Memory Materials Lab, Abrasive Water Jet Cutting Facility and Polymer Composites Lab. I am Dr. Martin Jabaraj. I am the Director R&D at BMS College of Engineering. I am very much happy and pleased to be in association with our Center of Excellence. I am going to just briefly talk to you about two aspects. The first aspect is MOU with industries and research organizations. We are associated with Tata Advanced Materials, specifically in the area of fiber reinforced plastics for aircraft industries. The CSIR giant National Aerospace Laboratory. With them also, we are in association with their advanced composite materials as well as sensor materials, NAPO technologies. They are nanotechnology specialists. Particularly, they are focusing on single wall carbon nanotubes, which are all applicable for solar and other energy related areas. The second aspect is transfer of technology to a village which will get benefit from our high-tech technological activities. In this, we have adopted the village and we are going to transfer the technology which is material related and naturally available resources. With the naturally available resources, they will be able to manufacture in a village sufficient quantity of kerosene for their own consumption. The objectives and importance of uh, establishing Center of Excellence at uh, BMS College of Engineering is to develop core competence in synthesis, processing and characterization of uh, metal matrix, polymer, nanocomposites and memory materials. At Center of Excellence in Advanced Material Research, we have state-of-the-art research facilities in the form of scanning electron microscope and X-ray diffraction analyzer. The application of scanning electron microscope will be materials characterization of metals, ceramics, polymers, composites, coatings, biological samples, etc. The X-ray diffraction analyzer is primarily used for phase identification of crystalline material and can provide information on unit cell dimensions. Applications of XRD includes phase ID, quantification, structure refinement, crystallographic work, polycrystalline thin film analysis, nanoparticle phase ID, nanoparticle size distribution, residual stress, micro diffraction, etc. Abrasive water jet cutting facility is established to investigate machining capabilities of abrasive water jets on advanced materials. Abrasive water jet cutting equipment has a direct drive pump of 30 HP, which can produce 350 megapascals. Abrasive water jets are used to cut different materials ranging from hard to brittle, uh, soft to ductile, thin to thick materials such as uh, uh, aluminum, concrete, uh, polymer matrix composites, metal matrix composites, ceramics, and so on. In this lab, we are working on several areas such as finding machining capabilities on uh, different uh, engineering materials like steels, metal matrix composites and also we are trying to develop mathematical models for the several outputs like surface finish and depth of cut and we are exploring the possibility of using abrasive water jet like turning and uh, 3D cutting to produce helical gaze. Several batches of UG students, PG students and PhD scholars are doing their research work in this lab. We also extend this facility to out outside students. We have set up polymer composites research lab under Center of Excellence in Advanced Materials Research. In this lab, we mainly concentrate the synthesis of conducting polymer, especially polypyrrole, and fillers like nanometals for making composites. For these synthesized composites, we characterize using SEM, XRD, and FTIR. Further, we are studying the properties like transport properties using AC as well as DC conductivity measurements. To measure DC conductivity, we have a Kithli instrument with a constant current source and a nano voltmeter with different temperatures. To study AC conductivity, we have an impedance analyzer with a wide range of frequency from 100 Hz to 5 MHz. With this facility, we can study AC conductivity. Also, 
we can study the dielectric behavior of the synthesized composites. As an application of these synthesized composites, we are exploring the possibility of these composites as humidity sensors. With these facilities, we have four part-time research scholars and one full-time research scholar working under Vishweshwaraya Technological University, Belgaum, under my supervision. The title of my project in Center of Excellence in Advanced Materials Research at BMS College of Engineering is Synthesis and Characterization of Phase Change Memory Materials. The phase change memories are considered to be a possible replacement for conventional non-volatile RAMs. The facilities which are available in this lab are Horizontal Rotary Furnace which is used for bulk glassy sample preparation, Hot Air Oven which is used for annealing purpose, High Accuracy Balance Meter which is used for weighing purpose, Flash and Resistive Evaporation Unit which is used for coating purpose, Dual Sputtering Unit used for thin film deposition purpose, Heatly Source and Measure Unit along with a custom built probe station which is used for electrical switching characterization. Currently, two PhD students are working in this lab. We are interested in collaboration for project work or research work in this area or related areas. 